Mad Honey, a novel by Jodi Pakul, tells a compelling story about love, secrets, and the complexities of human relationships. The narrative unfolds through the perspectives of two main characters, Olivia McAfee and her teenage son, Asher. Olivia McAfee's life dramatically changes after a tragic incident forces her to leave a high-powered career in law to return to her hometown of Adams, New Hampshire, to care for her ailing father and nurture her own adolescent son, Asher. She establishes herself as a local beekeeper, tending to her hives and selling honey, while Asher tries to fit in at a new school. Olivia's life is a struggle for normalcy after her divorce from her abusive husband, Knox, who is a renowned surgeon that continues to cast a shadow over their lives. Asher McAfee struggles with typical high school challenges but finds solace in photography, which enables him to see the world from different perspectives. Things start to improve for him when he meets Lily Campanello, a new girl in school with her own secretive past. The two teenagers quickly bond, and a relationship blossoms between these kindred spirits who both have experienced hardship and seek understanding in each other. Their romance seems like a teenage dream until the day Lily is found dead from apparent bee stings. The small town of Adams is shocked, and as details surrounding her death become murky, Asher becomes the prime suspect. The interwoven stories of Olivia and Asher delve into their attempts to grapple with this tragedy while facing the stigma and accusations from those around them. As the murder investigation unfolds, it is revealed that Lily was actually an alias used by a young girl running away from her own troubled life. Her real name was Jenna, and her history included an overbearing and puritanical family, leading her to seek escape and reinvent herself. Jenna's previous life slowly unravels as Asher is painted as the individual responsible for her death due to his role as her boyfriend and the presence of his beehives near her body. Olivia, convinced of her son's innocence, must put to use her latent legal skills to defend him. She is fiercely protective and believes in Asher's innocence, but as she digs deeper, she unearths secrets about Lily's, Jenna's past, including her escape from a religious sect and the pressures she faced. Olivia's exploration into Jenna's background exposes a cycle of abuse within Jenna's family, hinting at alternative explanations for her death. As Asher's case goes to trial, it becomes a spectacle that attracts national attention. Olivia's old friend from law school, Jordan McAfee, no relation, enters the story as Asher's defense attorney. Jordan finds himself confronting his own prejudices and preconceptions as he pieces together the real events leading to Jenna's death. Throughout the legal proceedings, significant doubt is cast on the claims against Asher. Testimonies and forensic evidence bring to light that Jenna's death could be a result of her own risky attempt to extract honey from a hive containing mad honey, which is toxic due to the consumption of rhododendron by the bees. The twist exposes the theme of mad honey, serving both as a metaphor for the intoxicating and sometimes harmful nature of love as well as a literal explanation for Jenna's tragic fate. The tension and uncertainty build, while Olivia confronts the reality that she might have misjudged her son's behavior and character, just as others had misjudged her during her marriage with Knox. Asher simultaneously faces the realization that he didn't fully know Jenna, and he must also confront the echoes of his father's abusive legacy within himself. In the tense climax of the trial, the book's pivotal themes of forgiveness, understanding, and the often painful truth come to the forefront. It's revealed that Jenna's death was the result of an accidental poisoning from mad honey, and the rash on her body was mistakenly believed to be bee stings. Asher's name is cleared, but his relief comes with the knowledge that his first love died in such an unfortunate way. The final chapters of Mad Honey reveal the characters attempting to find closure. Olivia, now seeing her son in a new light, must come to terms with her own biases and limited understanding of the people closest to her. Asher, his innocence affirmed, seeks to move forward with a heavy knowledge of loss and misunderstanding, leaning on the metaphors of photography and beekeeping to navigate the complexities of life. In Mad Honey, Jody Pakult explores the intricacies of human nature, the precarious bounds of relationships, and the truths that lie beneath the surface of a seemingly perfect facade. 
The novel invites readers to ponder the impacts of secrets and the courage it takes to face them, ultimately presenting a story that resonates with themes of redemption, love, and the strength found in community and forgiveness. You can listen to the full audiobook for free by following the URL in the description.